that word hope. Mm -hmm. That word makes makes a whole big difference yeah, out of yeah. every single thing that goes on. Because guess what? If you got hope, you got chance. Yeah. Yes. If you got hope, you got termination. Yeah. If you got hope, you got strength. Yeah. yeah.
today is, is prayer time. It's prayer time.
Bless me up right now. We love you today, God, and we need you. Tell us to be better Christian, the better school. Yes. Love, we're going to turn our word. Yes. God teaches God to be all you have to do. Yes. disciples say, God teaches how to pray. Yes. But God teaches how to serve. Yes. God teaches how to love one another. Yes. God, we need you right now. Yes. And we pray the word is coming for all today. Yes. That we'll be changed and be different. Bless your name. Give us a child of us will go back. Child destination. We we'll rest on tonight that we'll get up in the morning for the highways and highways that we'll compare. And God will be disciples across your universe. Bless your name, man. God, we thank you. We thank you. Help us, oh God, we honor you. We call us today. Thank you so much for this day and this night. We bless all your name. In this high place, in Jesus' name, in the church, in Jesus' name.
But it came back around and I felt better. Yeah. And I said, Jesus is fishing. Yeah. yeah. Amen. So Jesus thought he was going to go here. Yeah. Amen. When I went to go there, he said, He took him. Amen. 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 He took him. Yeah. And I won't say. Yeah, well, I think those were the uh, selections uh, when I wrote Yes. Then no one that Jesus said. No one. I ain't ready to go home. Yes. But when the time comes, I'm going to be like, I have a car. Thanks to the law. God, can you give me 15 more? Amen. Amen. It's a little bit more. But anyway, um, so we thank God for each of you. Um, I got a um, very uh, nice call here uh, from the uh, Graham family. Um, I would like to read if I can on behalf of Ada One. Um, it said, Thank you for your sympathy, kindness, lift us up, light our path, smooth the journey. See us through. Your sympathy and kindness will always be remembered. Uh, the God of the Graham Hill, this is Mr. and Mrs. Graham. I'm Amen. sorry. Amen. Amen. And it says, uh, the Graham family would like to thank Miriam Hustle for your kind, your thoughtful words during a time of our sorrow. Your prayer have mean so much. To us. Thank you for the lovely flowers arrangement. God bless you and continue to pray for us. Love you, the ground. Amen. Amen. We just thank God that at a time we were for me God God. Amen. We pray God give you all this credit that you would be uh, at a time like this. Amen. And we know God is able. Yes, he is. And it's all right to say God fix it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So God bless you. Uh, thank you so much for uh, your call. Now we'll go to some things we really remember. Right. Things that we can remember. Right. Okay. Something we don't need to remember. This is what we need to remember. Amen. Okay. Um, we're working with the guests. Thank God for all our guests on tonight. Here it is. Dynamite man of God, and God is so rich and blessed to live up to that. Uh, guess no, you work. Uh, please sign with the woman. Before we you know what we had, we might need to take a call. Keep it on silent. Be so kind. If you get one, just go out uh, uh, in the um, hallway. Just come in the loud. Just kind of step out the door and, um, you know, talk uh, to you or whatever. Now, uh, we're acknowledging today <coughs> birthdays, July birthdays, anniversaries, retirements, other special events you may have in July. Say so, uh, Last week I think I was out when they said something about anniversary. I knew the anniversary because my wife stood up.
two brothers, two uh, trustees, two community brothers, two town, and a number of of fever uh, uh, t-shirt. I think some got t-shirts on today. Um, so the idea we got Bible studies on uh, Wednesday night. Uh, got great teachers. Uh, young teacher on his past Wednesdays, but uh, Dean Gary did a great job uh, talking about the battle of the, the wall. What's going on? Uh, spiritual wall. So, yeah, it, 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 it's going to continue to Jesus though. But he did an awesome job, uh, so he, he was our teacher. So come out for Wednesday night and um, just uh, take a seat and help him help us to, you know, to grow with this battle that we're going to have until we go home. Uh, then we got um, some talk coming up in August, August uh, celebration Sunday. Uh, past like each one of us that we have to try to bring five. I'm going to celebrate uh, our Sunday. I'm going to try to show love. It's going to be in August, the August celebration. How all this stuff entails on that celebration. I don't know if it's going to be like a family screen thing and all this stuff. I don't really know. But it's going to be a uh, celebration Sunday. That's what we call it. And in November, you know, we got the annual conference going to be in the United States. Um, we got November the 7th. Uh, we'll be going um, to the United States for uh, our annual conference. We got so I think we got church in Portland. Wants to go for go with us. Try to get a package here. Perhaps you know more uh, about that. On that package deal, we um, going to get up and go to our annual conference with me uh, and Raleigh, uh, North Carolina. We're going to try to get back here. I think they said sometime in November, maybe November the 3rd. Uh, I think the uh, conference will start like uh, on the 7th, I believe, of November. That we uh, for the uh, our conference. And then we step into your call. Um, rebirth, you'll be seeking the uh, trustee, deacon, uh, teachers, preachers, whatever we are seeing, uh, to help this kingdom. Mm -hmm. uh, it's God's work, God can. God call you. Then we don't say no. Mm -hmm. But whatever. Uh, God will place you in grief, whatever. Uh, we uh, we see the choir, the praise team, whatever. Be in God's kingdom. Uh, we'll give God a place to do you want to do it for the Lord. Uh, rebirth is looking. We start. Okay? Um, pretty much. Uh, that is really. All I see on the announcements, I don't see anything else here on the announcement, but uh, go, I just have to call it, you know, we have, we have Sunday school every Sunday at uh, 9.30, first, third, and fifth is morning service with Sunday school. Second and fourth is on the Sunday school, then we'll come back to our afternoon service. First, third, and fifth. We have not good sense to we go into our Sunday morning uh, work. Mm -hmm. But Saturday and fourth, we do Sunday school in the morning, go home, and do that as we come back uh, at 7 o'clock to listen to the great speakers that God had uh, placed before us. So put that in your mind if you can. Uh, this is going to be very be glad to have you now. Uh, I'm great pastor, Kevin uh, McClain. We'd be glad to see your face in this Good evening, everybody. Good evening. Good evening, everybody. Good evening. We have indeed been blessed tonight. Amen. 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 But tonight we're going to be even more blessed. Tonight, our speaker of the hour has to be led. A Little Word Christian Church, Kuwait, my pastor. Amen. My brother. Amen. My prayer covering. Amen. And now, since you know he's my prayer covering, covering I'm going to ask of you. I say again. I'm going to ask of you. Amen. My sisters and brothers. Amen. To be a prayer covering 
for him tonight. Amen. Amen. He has an awesome responsibility to come before God's people and to bring God's word toward his people. It is not a simple task. And I pray for him and all that steps up behind this sacred pulpit mm -hmm. that we are doing our responsibility. Mm -hmm. Pray a prayer covering over this man's servant of God. Mm -hmm. Not only this man's servant, but all the servants of the Most High. Mm -hmm. The song says he has done great things for me. Yes. Pastor elect a weeper of Living Word Christian Church to wait. Minister Williams is going to stand before us and bring those words of great things that our Father is doing and has done for us. I pray that we give him our divine attention so that we will receive what the Lord has for us to receive. Amen. 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 After weeks before, before Pastor Elect, Mr. Williams come before us, we want to have a symbolic selection. Amen. Give heed to the word of God. Amen. 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 Amen.
just chatting about it. Amen? So I thank God for his time talking with you. I give honor to the Heavenly Father as well as his Son, Jesus Christ, to my elder, to the absent pastor, as well as my pastor, here and everyone walking with God. Mm -hmm. I welcome y'all to Rebirth House of Hope. Amen. Mm -hmm. Say that again. Amen. Rebirth House of Hope. Mm -hmm. now, I'm going to talk to you a little bit. I'm sorry. Because I'm here. That word, hope, mm -hmm. that word makes, makes a whole big difference yeah, out of yeah. every single thing. They go on because, look, guess what? If you got hope, you got a chance. Yeah. Yes. If you got hope, you got termination. Yeah. If you got hope, you got strength. Yeah. yeah. Amen. Amen. I appreciate Amen. you. Amen. It is wonderful to be in the house of the Lord one more time. Mm -hmm. Yes. Tonight, God is wanting to talk to you, talk to us about spiritual warfare. Mm -hmm. Right now. His question, are you ready for the battle? Mm -hmm. Are you about ready? How many military people that I have here? Amen. All right, amen. Now the ones that have them is not military over the world. I know you've seen the movies and all that. Amen. In military time, and I was in the military, before we decided to go out to a battle, there was preparation. Mm -hmm. <laughs> there was finding gathering information to be able to go out to the battle. We had our IT guys listening in on cryptic messages. Mm -hmm. We sent infantry members then out there to go behind the lines to find out different information. Mm -hmm. Amen? But in God's spiritual warfare, it is a little bit different. Amen? Amen. First, first of all, I want you to understand this is not a physical battle. No. Amen. You're not going to have Satan stand in front of you, you and him, start going punches. Mm -hmm. Amen? Right, yeah, you're not going to get it. Not yet. Amen. You ain't going to be swinging with him like we would be when we was kids. Amen? Amen. And this is a spiritual battle. And with a spiritual battle, there's some different techniques mm -hmm. and methods that you have to use mm -hmm. to battle this battle. Mm -hmm. right. But you can't battle something if you don't know what you're battling. Amen. That's right. Oh, no. That's right. Amen. Amen. I just want to make sure we're ready. The, the words that like said in Ephesians, Ephesians 12, 6 and 12, it said, we're wrestling against flesh. And look, not, not, not against, not, 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 I'm not, 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 the past. Right right. He said, this age. Uh, all right. He's talking about 2018, right. not, to, not back in 1963. Uh, He's talking about now. Amen? Amen. Against spiritual hopes, hosts of wickedness uh, in the heavenly places. Uh, let's talk a moment about, let's talk about that heavenly place. Uh -huh. Where's the heavenly place in there? Where, where, where? On earth. All around us. All around us. Okay, is it any other? I mean, it isn't specific. Did you? you see the heaven is all around? All heaven. Anywhere you go. Is this a heavenly place? Amen. Yes, yes, it is. Do we have wickedness coming into the heavenly place at this time? Everything on there. And is it knocking at the church door? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Right then. Yes. Amen. So, Come on. 
So this has already been foretold that this was coming. Amen. 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 We're going to go ahead and continue. We're going to break down the strategy of the enemy. Amen. Amen. The enemy fights us in three basic areas. Mm -hmm. For the unbeliever, he fights us in blind. Well. What are you like about? No, I pass it What do you mean, Mr. Smith? Most unbelievers are confused. They'll walk around in a daze. Mm -hmm. They don't know which way to turn. Amen. They get in doctrine from every which way, but not the right doctrine. Amen. They walk around just as confused and buffooned. Mm -hmm. Do you know that's the easiest way for Satan to get in? Amen. The door is open. He clears a path easily to get and destroy mm -hmm. this vessel. Well, let me regress on one thing because I didn't mention something that everybody needs to know. All right. So, Satan is a thief. Well, yes, he is. is. With Satan being a thief, he is a sneak. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I said this before in one ministry, and I'm going to say it again. Satan do like this. He step in, mm -hmm. do what he have to do, and step out. Amen? Amen? He don't have to stay long to start confusion. All, right. All he's got to do is set the seed. Mm -hmm. And guess what? We let it grow. Amen? All right, Amen? And, amen. We start putting a whole lot of water on it. And then start to add some the growth fruit, the, the fertilizer. fertilizer to it, make it get bigger. And, and before you know it, we don't got it so big, we can't be taking no control. So that's why I said we have to remember who we are dealing with. You're dealing with a snake mm -hmm. that slithers into your life and slithers right back out. A snake only bites you once and then he's gone. He put the venom in and he's out of the way. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Amen? Amen. Uh, in 2 Corinthians, the fourth chapter, uh -huh. the third and the fourth verse, well. it says, but even if even our gospel is veiled, it is veiled to those who are perishing. Whose mind the God, whose mind the God of this age uh -huh. has blinded. Oh my God. All right. Who do not believe, lest the light of the gospel of the glory of Christ, who is the image of God, who shine on them. Uh -huh. Basically, he's telling me we have forgot who. Brought us in. Who sustained us because we have allowed Satan to slide in? We're not equipped with everything that we need to keep him from coming out. We're going to talk about what are the things we need to battle and to make sure that he don't come in. Amen? Amen. But I want you to know the strategy. His strategy is to slide in. Amen. His strategy is to get under your helmet. His strategy is to get under your breastplate. Your breast uh -huh. That's his strategy to slide in. Amen. Once he's done what he needs to do, he slides out. Amen. 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 The second basic thing that he does, the basic error is called he is assaults the belief. Okay. Yes. Give them, giving them the fall from God's grace. My, my God. What do you mean, Mr. Williams? Satan deceives the ones that are babes in Christ. Okay. He gives them a false illusion that God does not love them. Mm -hmm. That God 
that God is not with them. Amen. God is not walking with them. God is not talking with them. My God. Because these are, I mean, you, you got to think about it. I'm a baby. I'm just learning the word. Right. I'm just learning to spend time with God. I might just be rich trying to read the word. But don't understand me. Amen. There's a door opening there mm -hmm. for Satan. Amen. To say that, hey, you see how confusion, confusing the word is. It's not for you. Jesus. And then once you start, it's just like, a, like I started a room. Amen. I start this room right here. I guarantee by the time I get back to Brother Eton, it's a whole different thing. It's a whole different thing. Satan comes in and gives you something different from what the word say. He gives you so profound that you don't understand what you just read because he's done gave it four, five different ways. But she's never the true way. Mm -hmm. So before you know it, you're lost. Mm -hmm. Just reading one simple verse. Amen? Amen. Amen. So this is another basic way that Satan gets in in his strategy of attack. His third is one of the men's worst, worst attack. Temptation. Amen. You remember when we were growing, they said that they used to say that we like to think that the grass on the other side is better. But is that how it goes? It's green on the other side. Okay. Somebody give me correct. What did it be? Green on the other side. But we run over to that green on the other side, don't we? We run over there, don't we? Just to go sit. To us with temptation. Oh, we put the most loveliest things in front of us. Mm -hmm. The thing that they just be smiling. Oh, that looks so lovely. Oh, that house. That, oh, that's a lovely house. Oh, and knowing that God had not said this yet for you. <laughs> haven't said this yet for you. But you, you know, he don't prompt you up. Oh, we can do this. Go get about four or five more. You can get it. 